So I'm Morgan. I'm doing a seven day test drive of the Honda Fit. So this is kind of sad. This is my last, my last time driving the Honda Fit. I had a, um, a really entertaining week with this car. I think she's really cute. I have decided to name her Yoko. I like the color. I didn't at first, but now I, I sort of do. I'm sort of fond of Milano Red. When I first got in the car, honestly, it felt sort of like a lot of new cars. It felt clean, it looked bright, it looked shiny. It had that kind of new sense to it. So of course I was gonna be impressed with it. But um, as that initial kind of blush wore off, I got a sense of the car better, and I drove it a lot. And I found out that it actually has a lot of features that are sort of important to me whether it's having a shift mode that I can downshift around tight corners in San Francisco, whether it's just being compact enough that I can park it in a busy downtown city street. I like the fact that I can play music on a USB flash drive, plug that puppy in, or on an iPod if I want to. I fell in love with the car as I, as I drove it and the more I, I hung out with it. I think I'm gonna miss Yoko. I know I'm gonna miss Yoko. Yoko, don't worry, baby. I'll see you again soon. It's gonna be a sad day tomorrow when I I have to hop on my bike again. This was a seven day test drive. It wasn't an infinite test drive. And this is my last day driving the car. It's funny how you can get to know someone or something pretty well within seven days. At first I was sort of shy around the Honda Fit. And then bit by bit, day by day, I was just driving and parking and driving and parking. It enabled me to uh, get to know the car better. Three adjectives to describe the Honda Fit. Surprising, capable, and cute as a button. Does that count? That's a number of different words, but I figured it's like one adjective. It just seems like the car is just supremely reliable. That combined with Honda's reputation, I can't help but think that it's, it's a capable car. Rate the car from one to five? Five. It's easy. Why Yoko? It's a good question. Yoko was a muse for John Lennon and a vehicle for his own individual artistic freedom or expression. So maybe there's some kind of a symbolism there that I can apply. What else can I say about her? I think it's a really sweet little car and that's why I'm gonna miss her. People or cars, it's the same thing. Saying goodbye is difficult for someone that you care for. I should have known though, you know, because it wasn't forever, it was gonna last forever. It's only seven days. She's a, she's a good little Honda. <laughs>